Hey guys, just a short video today about a few things that I really missed from the closed beta testing. For those of you that have been around, you likely remember how exciting the anti-aircraft gun fire was. As planes got close, your long range would pop off, and as the planes got even closer, your close range would explode like confetti. It really was a sight to behold, and one of the more authentic and cooler things about the game. I had to dig into my archives for these shots. For those around back then, feel free to reminisce. For those newer to the game, this is what we once had. I really hope Wargaming brings it back, and makes it an option that can be turned on or off so that high-speed machines can experience it once again. It really didn't tax my machine that much, and I'm running AMD. You can see from my frame counter, very little drop-off at all. So yeah, bring back the CBTAA. Next is the Measure 22 scene here on US ships. This is better known as Atlantic Two-Tone Camouflage and consisted of a blue hull and gray superstructure. Again, very cool and very authentic. I don't know why this was done away with, but I'd love to see this historically accurate camo make a reappearance at some point. There are a few other things I miss about the CBT, another being my chance to try the Kitakame, but the two items I mentioned are at the top of the list for me. Wargaming? Please? Anyhow, take it easy everyone. For now you'll just have to imagine the anti-aircraft is there the way it should be.